is now. It's like there is, you know everything about a game before it's out. Yeah, it's true. You guys might remember. Oh, yeah. Check out, check out the floor in this level. Oh yeah, it does this in a couple places. Where, like the, the holy crap! Things, like, look how high I can jump. This is like every single dream I've ever had. Okay, I gotta get out of here. It's too much fun. Oh yeah, yeah. The camera's almost impossible to control. Oh my god. Ooh, okay, yeah, this is definitely a trippy-ass level. Music's amazing, though. This is, you might, you might remember, this is the this is the theme song to Benny. It's one of them. It's the, one of the many theme songs to Benny, because happy, cheery music is what Benny's about. And Knights fits that effin' perfectly. Ooh, I see a secret. Let's go. I need two more. One. Bonus time begin! If I wanted to, like, yeah, get, like, a super high grade right here, I would sit and... Ooh, I almost had a 15 link right there. That was really good. Yeah, if you're able to link the whole level, which you can do, um, that's how you get ridiculous scores. Like, ridiculous scores. Once you know exactly where to boost, because the game rewards you for boosting by once you hit, hit links and get stars and, and orbs and stuff, it gives you more boost gauge. So literally, you boost, you get more boost gauge, boost, you get more boost gauge, and you can ch chain link the entire level. Whoa, what the, what the fuck? Very weird. So weird. <laughs> well, you know what I like about this game? Something that I learned to appreciate like later in life when I started playing games is uh, sound design. The sound design in this game is amazing. All the little confirmation sounds are like ridiculously satisfying. Oh god, jeez! Why am I fat? What the fuck? Obesity or something. Weird. No, I don't want to be fat! Okay. We're in the clear. I'm not fat. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Thank you, sir. Oh, I think that re re revitalizes your boost gauge. It completely ah. went all the way up when I did it. Maybe. Could be wrong. Like, they have different signs. Like, one of them had, like, a clock on one. And yeah. And had, like, like, an angel on a like, naked angel baby. Naked angel baby! Naked angel baby! I guess naked's kind of an overstatement, but, uh... What the hell? Whatever. Oh, God. Oh, my... Star oh, my Fox. God! You know, it's kind of funny. I said in, uh, my review of Journey of Dreams, like, you know, there was a lot more promise in this franchise than there was in Sonic. And they... I was really hoping, like... Sonic team would have either maybe not if they didn't ditch Sonic at least like do like switch off every year like do a Knights game and do a Sonic game and I that still think cool. I still think there's a lot more untapped potential in this franchise and like it's just too different and too weird and they get too scared yeah it's it's a lot harder to market a game like this nowadays like pretty much this game will only sell based off nostalgia yeah, but if you get it like it's great. Once yeah, you get it. that's the thing. Is like that's what I the, playing this game at the start is like ridiculous and it's oh there's a hidden you see that there was a hidden uh, orbs there. It, it's ridiculous and it doesn't make any sense and it's confusing and it looks weird. But when you actually understand knights and you start playing it, it's like it's like being really good at a Sonic game. Like things are just flying by so f ridiculously fast and you watch somebody and it's like how are you even controlling what's happening? You see that those are reflections in the yeah, wall and they were still yeah, giving yeah. them to me. There's no secret. I don't want to get fat. I don't want to get fat. Let's go. Like this whole level, everything bounces and squishes. Ooh, what's that? Something with wings. What's funny, like picking up this game again is like riding a bike. When you first play Knights, it's like awkward and you don't know what the hell you're doing. I just want to get the egg. 
Oh my god, Justin Wong wants to join an Xbox Live party. His name. Yes, that's Justin Wong. Yeah. I should maybe do it, but I don't have anything hooked up for sound right now. Maybe we should go in there. Hold <laughs> on. I'm gonna do it. You gotta beat the boss. I gotta beat the boss first. We'll see what game he's playing. Then we'll then we'll fight Justin Wong at Knights vs. Mode. He's gonna wanna play Tekken Tag 2 or some other thing. What <laughs> the hell is going on? He's a card dealer. What a dick! Okay. Uh, oh, I remember this. Okay, you have to like... You have to like throw the cards. Throw the cards, asshole. And you have to like follow him around. Just, like, throw him. Put him in the guillotine. What a dick! What a card throwing dick! Oh, damn it. It's gotta be something I'm missing. No, nope, not falling for your crap. Shit, man, they like all oh, but you me. are. Gah! What the hell? What is homing missile bullshit? Oh, oh it's so bad. Got him! I need to get to the thing before he does. I have to throw him into the guillotine. Oh! I remember this happening in before. Where it's like you, you repeatedly throw him, but he doesn't die. Um, you gotta do something. Well, the game will probably tell me right now. What is it? Remove Jackal's cape before attacking. And then you smash the cape? Or him. Weird. Weird. I remember the bosses being like this when I first played the game, where it's just like trial and error. And you just gotta go back and play the whole damn game again. Which is not that bad because Knights is fun. Do you wanna try this time? Yeah, I'll try. I... Give it a shoot! This girl looks, looks like she's at a Fantasy Star online. Boink. Go Knights! Save the dreams! Remember as a kid, I wanted the soundtrack of this game to help me sleep. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of like designed for that. Yeah. I uh, I used to have like terrible nightmares as a kid sometimes and it would, you didn't, like, didn't want to sleep. Like, I, think every, I think everybody goes through that phase at some point. Uh, and I would always fire up like game soundtracks and stuff like that. I remember like trying to sleep to the... Ooh, go up. Uh, there we go. I remember having the soundtrack to Metal Gear Solid, and that would help me put to sleep, like the uh, the final song, like the yeah song at the end of Metal Gear One soundtrack. Uh, best is yet to come. Yeah, yeah, that song is amazing, and um, what the stuff hell? like that would help. The you ever have those dreams where you uh, you realize you're in a dream? Yep. Those are fucking weird. I haven't had one like that for like ten years, but those were some interesting evenings. They're called lucid dreams. Yeah. Playing Xbox 360 is supposed to be like in one, according to Peter Moore. Oh, it's very true. Peter Moore's right about everything. <laughs> Especially now that he's at EA. Yeah. Playing playing Madden is like a lucid dream. Yeah, one. One you, one you can't out. wake up from. When you can't wake no! up from. When you want to get out of a please, no more. here. You gotta put the. <laughs> you gotta. <laughs> Can't even do a bad impression. <laughs> Whenever somebody tries to do there's a character called the Knight, sir, and they fly through the got rain. Ten seconds left. Fifteen yeah. seconds. And that's called. Go back. Go back. Go back. Go back. Go back. You can make it. You can make it, man. Don't let your child break out of you. You'll lose all your delicious points. Go faster. Go. Go. Yes. Oh my God. There's one second left. Yeah. And I got oh! an A. So that's how you do it. You just have to spend your time. You're right. Yep. I definitely... I should have swore this was one of those games where the game rewarded you for a bonus time. It does! When you get getting to the globe fast. Gotcha. Gotcha. Okay, so it's... You get you get them... You get the orbs as fast as you possibly can, and then the yeah. bonus time after that is just... Yeah, it's all about links. It's just bonus that. juice. You have to touch those things to break them open, yeah. Slows you down. Yeah, lucid dreams are freaking weird. Like, the dreams where you actually... 
like you do the, the classic thing where you pinch yourself in a dream yeah and straight up it doesn't work yeah. I, I remember being in a dream once and I must have pinched myself in real life while I was like half asleep but I remember it hurting and yeah. it was like oh shit we are so effed <laughs> like being chased by a rhino or some shit like that <laughs> that was a shitty evening oh my god I'm fat Cartman nights oh yeah guys wow look at that nights created nights in the dreams also made Cartman before South Park existed it came out at the same time no nights made it nostalgia wins Well, you know what this game would be amazing for? Um, touch devices. Don't, I think don't, don't give Sega ideas. <laughs> but I oh, mean, touch devices is a great idea. Let's just make an iPad. Okay, to be honest, to be honest, Knights I, will be an iPad game forever. I, well, all things considered, what they did with the sequel to Knights doesn't exactly give me much hope for what they would do with it a little bit more. I would rather, I'd rather more people be playing Knights on whatever device than people not. And I would take 10 Journey of Dreams before I'd play a fucking iPhone version of Knights. Well, if, they had, if it handled well, if it handled well, it doesn't matter. <laughs> You're just an old hateful man. I'm hateful towards fucking touch control, yes. <clears throat> well, yeah. this game, all, all you really do is press up and down, and circles. Arr! Fine. You Get wanna, your balls! You wanna do a touch thing? Then just put it on the freaking Wii U's little tablet controller. Have, have a nice day. Well, that's what they made it for. Mobile gaming as a console! Oh, 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 oh my god! Oh, Jesus! You are tearing apart the dream world, sir. It's okay. You're killing tons of children okay. as we speak. The dream world, thank me. <laughs> the dream world will thank me. Guys, seriously, this place is fucked up. You gotta get out of here. There's there's floors on the ceiling and there's upside down water and gestures and naked babies. Get out of here! And you get medals. Bail out, bail out. Actually, they look like cone heads. You see that? Yeah, you gotta do. And they follow you around. Holy hell! If I had a cone head elf baby following following me around in my dream, I'd find the quickest way out of there. I tell you, make me a sandwich. Cone head <laughs> naked elf baby, make me a sandwich. I have not seen a kitchen yet in Nights, so hopefully in the sequel. Yeah, if there's one game I'll, I'll probably will not do a Let's Play for would be Journey of Dreams, because I'd want to ignore all the segments where you have to be the kid. You know what you could do? You know, if you were going to do a Journey of Dreams, you do, like, like you play on my system with a completed file and just go to the good levels. And just go to the good levels? <laughs> the last level and ignore, ignore all the horrible, horrible cutscenes. Oh, Jesus, I remember that. Like, the music in that game was good. Like, everything about that game yeah. seemed like it would be good, but then you actually... But then it's like, oh, we have to listen to the kids talk, and... Jesus. Yeah, and then try to make a story out of this. I mean, I liked how the game had a tutorial hub world. Like, I thought that was good for Knights, because it, it helped ease people into what the hell you were supposed to do. Yeah. Good, good idea there, but, like, I don't want to, like, listen to, like, these horrendous-looking 3D models talk. Animated, yeah, 3D models. They were not... Good. Knights, Knights Journey of Dreams was only good when you when you were knights. When you were knights and flying around, like, and they actually had some pretty creative yeah. levels. Classic knights, not like car knights or roller coaster knights. But to be honest, it looked it looked just about as good as this. Yeah, not, I mean, this it looks, looks a little uh, bit better. Uh, no, no. The, like the game looked a little bit. I'm kind of that's kind of what bums me out because like I don't know if you've seen like the footage for the knights level in Sonic All Stars Racing, uh -huh. but like it's made to look like like this. Yeah. Like like an HD up res of a Saturn game. Like they they're not trying to like push the H you know, the, the graphical power of you know, modern consoles on it. And it kinda of bums me out because it it's like, oh well so really Journey of Dreams is like the best looking graphical knights game. Uh, that kinda of, it's kinda of sad. Yeah. I, I fear you. Why well, you just hit like a port and find? Because like you fly through these these rings in the game. And the rings are still 2D, even in All-Star Racing. <laughs> that's awesome. It's kind of awesome, but at the same time, it's like... <laughs> no, that's awesome. I kind of really would like to see, a, a, you know, like what they did with the Parents of Dragoon level. That's true. So what do we have to do here? You have to go after his cape. You have to hit him first and then get his cape off. Try not to get slaughtered by crazy shit. Oh, okay, so he's going back to his cape right now. You have, to, you have to attack him. 
Just keep attacking him. Just keep attacking him. Okay, yeah. We were doing the right thing. He goes, what? I remember that sound effect happening, like, repeatedly. And that's how I... Okay. And that's how I got to him before, too. You go really high, and it's harder to throw the cards at you. No, asshole! Get away from your clothes. You will go nude in this dream forever. Constantly naked, sitting awkwardly in a classroom. Waiting for things to be over. What the hell? You got him, though. Ah, oh, I can't... You have to believe, Simmons. You have to believe. Yes! Yes! Kick his freaking naked ass! Yes! So that was it. We were actually doing it right before. We just had to do it faster. And not get hit by the cards all the time. Yeah. Actually. So when you go, fuck you, you're up and down and you're gonna hit by cards. I got a B. I got a B, son. Because you took your sweet ass time. That's what you're supposed to do. It's a score-based game. Sweet ass time.